So once you've finished your project, you're most likely thinking, how can I upload this to YouTube? It's the most common thing people do with their videos. And we have a few ways of doing it inside Final Cut. Now, the simplest way is to use the built-in YouTube export setting in Final Cut. And if you've not used it before, I'll show you how to set it up. First of all, make sure you've got your project selected, then come up to File, Share, Add Destination. And you can see here all the different destinations that Final Cut supports, including YouTube. Now, if I double click that, I, I can add YouTube to my destinations. And you can see here I can set some properties. So I can set my default resolution to be 1080p. I can choose whether I want my encoding to be faster or better quality. I can choose the default privacy for my video. So you can choose private, unlisted or public, which match the settings on YouTube. Or you can, and you can also choose what category you want your video to be in. These can be changed later, but basically it's the default setting that you want to appear on YouTube. Generally, I set this to unlisted. The reason being is that I let my upload complete, I check it on YouTube, and then I will make it public. So we've not quite finished. We also need to sign into our YouTube account. So click the sign in button, click sign in again. And you can see I'm taken to a Google page in Safari and I can choose whether I want to use my current account. These are some of the accounts I'm logged in with or create a new account. In this case, I'm just going to choose my personal account. It asks me which if I want to upload to my, my account or the brand attached to my account. I'm just going to choose my account again. And now I need to give it permission. I will do that. And now you can see here, um, it's put the name of my account next to the YouTube name. So if I come back, click my project, file, share, YouTube, and the account. Now I get the same menu that we'll see in a lot of places. So I can see these settings again in case I want to change them for this specific video. And I can also change the title the description, the creator, and the tags. Now you can see here I've actually got a warning. If I hover over it, it says that I've got too many tags. So I'll just delete delete the tags. And then um, you can see as well that I've got an estimation of how big the file is going to be. I don't have a file name, of course, because I'm uploading directly to YouTube. So file name doesn't matter. So I can hit next recheck the disclaimer and click publish. So if I click up here on the background tasks icon, I can see now that my share task has appeared and then Final Cut will start by writing out the file and then uploading it to YouTube. By the way, you can see now um, my upload originally is telling me the progress of the upload moving along quite quickly. So now my task has finished uploading. I can click the visit button and it'll take me to the YouTube page. Uh, it's still being processed at the moment, but shortly the video will appear there. 